Hi, welcome to Gramophone Music Studio YouTube channel. In today's video, I'll be talking about a complete guide to the Trinity Digital Exam, including the exam components, recording guideline, and video recording steps. Before we begin with the video, you should check out our past videos about Trinity exam information, ABRSM versus Trinity comparison video, and explaining music exam components in layman's terms. Please subscribe to our channel for more contents like this. First and foremost, what is Trinity Digital Exam? It is a new mode of exam introduced in 2020. The exam is assessed remotely via video recording submission. It is available every month of the year and it is available from grade initial to grade 8, ATCL and LTCL. Trinity will continue to offer both face-to-face -face exam and digital exam. They share the same qualification and recognition. Let's look at the exam components and marks. It consists of three pieces, which are 22 marks each, which equals to 66 marks. The technical work, 14 marks. Performance delivery and focus, 10 marks. And musical awareness, 10 marks. The candidate should select three pieces from the current syllabus. The syllabus overlapping is applicable as well. And the marking criteria is the same as face-to-face -face exam. You may check out our past videos for more information. The technical work includes skills, exercises, studies, and so on. The candidate should select groups according to your respective instrument and grade. For more details, check out the link in description. The performance delivery and focus is a new aspect for digital exam, which will be judged based on the focus, assurance, and continuity of the overall performance. And also the candidate's ability to sustain musicianship skills throughout the performance, as well as their ability to maintain focus between pieces and technical work. Musical awareness is also a new aspect. Examiner will look for the ability to demonstrate a sustained awareness of the appropriate interpretations of their pieces, whether they can move fluidly between the styles and genres, a sustained commitment to the personal interpretation of the score, and also the confidence in delivery of performance. The level attainment remains the same as face-to-face -face exam. To pass, you need 60 marks and above, to get married, you need 75 marks and above, and for distinction, you need 87 marks and above. Candidates may record the video at any suitable venue. As for piano candidates, they can use upright piano, grand piano, and also digital piano that is touch sensitive and has weighted keys for the graded exams. For COVID special arrangements in the event of lockdown or restriction, digital piano would be acceptable for all grades and diploma. For instruments with piano accompaniment, live accompaniment will be the most ideal. For COVID special arrangement by Trinity also accepts performance with backing tracks or solo performance without accompaniment. Digital exam shares the same recognition and certificate as face-to-face -face exam. Grade 6 to 8 will grant the same UCAS points for UK college or university admission. Moving on to the recording guidelines, the video should be in one continuous take and unedited. So 720p is recommended. You can do it in portrait or landscape mode. The camera should be static at all time. The audio and visual must be recorded simultaneously. Only one external mic is allowed if using. The candidate, instrument, original book or legally downloaded copy must be seen clearly. Here is an example for the piano candidate. And this is for the guitar candidate. And also instruments with the piano accompaniment. Before recording, candidates should prepare the original exam book, a technical work group on the printed paper, and ensure there's sufficient storage and battery level for the recording device. As for attire, there is no specific requirement by Trinity, but we recommend formal attire as in public performance. 
Now let's talk about the video recording steps. No introduction is required. The candidates can choose to start with pieces in the performance order or a technical work followed by the other. For technical work, you may print out the pitch that has the list of scales or an arpeggios to play. You have to show the front and back of the paper to the camera to prove there is no writing or notes on it. Close your book when playing scales from memory. Here is an example. You may start from scales, exercise, then pieces, or start from pieces, then scales and exercises. The registration can be done with your local Trinity representative. For those in Malaysia, you can register on Trinity Malaysia website. You have to register at least one month before your desired exam month. For example, you want to take the exam in April, you should register by early March. Select the exam month, fill in the candidate's information and pay. You will receive an email containing the upload link for the Trinity Learning Portal at the beginning of the exam month. You will then have 14 days to upload after receiving the email. For video submission, simply log into the Trinity Learning Portal with username and password provided in the email. You will have 14 days to upload from the date. You are advised to record 2-3 to three weeks before the exam month as late submission will not be accepted. You also have to complete a declaration before uploading. You will have to prepare these files to be uploaded. First, the exam video you have to rename to such format the candidate name underscore type instrument underscore grade. For example, Cindy Lim underscore classical piano underscore grade 3. And also a completed submission information form as well as a copy of piece that is not from the exam book if applicable. Now, I'll guide you on filling the submission information form. You will download this form from the link in description. Firstly, take the exam type, fill in the instrument and grade, candidate's name, and also the date of submission. And then, fill in the exam pieces according to your performance order, and tick if you have any own choice piece or own composition. And then fill in the technical work information and also list down all the skills and arpeggios or exercises that you are performing. And lastly, complete the declaration and also list down if you use a syllabus under an overlap arrangement or the COVID special arrangements. And now we're done. The exam fees will be based on grades and will be updated every year. You can look for the information on Trinity website. The result can be checked via Trinity Learning Portal within 2-4 to four weeks time. The certificate will be posted out by the local representative after they received it from the London office. The infringements include The video is not recorded under one take the indication of pulse or entry cue given to candidate or a playing of an additional instrument. This may result in disqualification. For access arrangements, you have to fill in a special needs form and submit immediately to this email address after registration. You will be granted extra time for video recording or just so the examiner is aware of the condition. If needed, candidates can take a break and move out of shot from camera or have the camera turned away from them. They may also receive assistance from the parent or carer during the break. The video recording should go on during this time. And here are some tips to record. First, use a tripod. Second, test the camera position. Third, rehearse multiple times before the actual recording. And fourth, get ready all items needed. And fifth, have some small breaks in between the pieces. And sixth, listen back to the recording for areas to improve. And that's all we have to cover for the Trinity Digital Exam. The PDF version of this video and all the documents mentioned in this video can be downloaded for free. Check out the link in the description box. Drop us a comment if you have any questions or if this video helps you. 
It keeps us motivated in putting up new contents for you. All information is correct by the date of publication. In the event of any discrepancies or inconsistency, Trinity's information shall prevail. Thanks for watching and we hope to see you next time.